You cannot hope that you win this game. You need to believe it. Do you understand what I'm saying? You need to believe you're going to score a goal. Go out there, play with heart, play for one another, and win. From this first moment I stepped foot on this campus, I think the people are what make it great. I've just had incredible support in what we're looking to do and accomplish here with the women's soccer program. I'm a pretty competitive person and I wanted the opportunity to, to not only win championships, but also be at a place that I, I truly could sell and love living at. Everyone's recruiting process is unique, and I think that's been one of the things I've realized talking to all my teammates. The Academy wants you to find a home here, and they want you to be able to mold it and find who you are as a leader and figure out who you are as a teammate in your own way. So I think that's one of the things that drew me here was just the invitation to figure out who I want to be going into the future as a leader. I knew that USAFA would give me plenty of opportunities. So one, it's free. Two, I'm gonna meet some really incredible people, right? High caliber people. And then I think three, I have a job waiting for me. And not only do I have a job, but I have an organization that's gonna pay for me to do whatever I want to do. I had the opportunity to fly gliders, to jump out of planes. I spent a semester in France. I soloed a powered flight. I went to pilot training. I got to go to Harvard for graduate school. Like I got all kinds of opportunities. And I think that is what sort of drew me to USAFA. Just seeing the seniors and the firsties during job drops and during graduation last year, it was very exciting and you can tell that they were very proud of themselves, proud of each other. Just the opportunities that this place gives you is just endless and I think it's one of the greatest reasons why I came here. My goal coming here as a head coach is to provide a Division One experience just like any other would have whether it's scouting reports or a video breakdown, traveling, it really feels like a professional environment. I wanted to feel a part of a program that's moving in the right direction and that just having the ability to feel like I'm growing since my club days, of, that I'm more of a college athlete because I'm thinking at a higher level, we're playing at a higher level, we're looking at what we eat and going to the HPL lab and getting DEXA scans and having a bunch of things that are really unique that we have here with the technology and focusing on all aspects of the game. They're using the lens of soccer and that to bring together a team that I think will ultimately benefit the Air Force. But when we salute before games to the flag as the national anthem plays, because it kind of shows how proud we are that we've made it here to the academy. It shows what we represent. We just look really clean out there. And I think that's just one thing that I really like about playing soccer here is that we're able to show that off. Home games, you have your peers, your other fellow cadets, you have teachers and other officers in the Air Force currently active that are behind you, supporting you. Some people might say it's a little intimidating, we, we feed into it, we love that. We just love playing in that environment. We are so good in terms of making the entire unit work well together, you know? And it, it's cool to watch because everybody wants a team that looks cohesive and, and is on the same page. And it's just so easy here. They're not afraid to communicate. They're not afraid to, to work together. And I'm like, you guys do this every day when you march. You have to pay attention to the person in front of you and you have to stay in sync with them. It's no different in the back line. We can't have one player that's just straying out of that line. We have to, to work as a unit. There's a lot of parallels between what we do in soccer and, and what they do up the hill militarily. The things that are unique about our team culture here is that we really truly are a sisterhood. We all recognize similar things and we've all just gone through a lot of things together that make it so that when we step on the field, we're all going out there for each other, we're rooting for each other. Just those shared experiences help us to encourage each other and be more positive as a unit. Go somewhere where you're celebrated, not where you're tolerated. And I think that's something that our program really embodies. We celebrate the unique things that every single person brings to this program. And I think that that's not something that you're gonna find anywhere else. And that's what drew me to here is that you're gonna be celebrated for your accomplishments, you're gonna be coached through and your friends are gonna help you through the things that you're struggling with and who you are as a person is really gonna be celebrated and that the people around you have your back and they want you to succeed.
having that team is, is really valuable at USAFA because it's tough. There's no doubt a service academy is a hard place to be. And so the women's soccer team just gives them that really special camaraderie and it's across all of the classes. So I wouldn't get overwhelmed with everything. I would you know, realize that there's a, a myriad of steps between the end goal and the Air Force is willing to work anybody through those steps to get you to becoming that commissioned lieutenant. There's a framework here that really allows you to become the best version of yourself when you leave here, not only as a soccer player, but as a person. That is Air Force soccer. That is the future of this program. And I expect that quality, that effort, every single time we step on the field. Understand, you have it within yourself to be great. You just have to believe it. And tonight, you had the courage, even when the game was on the line, to play out against that team, and you were better. You deserve this win, and I am so freaking proud of you guys for the effort that you gave tonight. Way to go.